Mercy land. A rain of solution and power. Mercy land. A rain of solution and power. Mercy land. A rain of solution and power. To God be the glory that today we are standing as a family to testify of his goodness. The woman standing beside me is my lovely wife, Esther Ugochuku. My own name is Dennis Ugochuku. I'm from Imo State and I reside at Bonny Island. My, our testimony goes like this. It was in 2014 that I met my wife, then my wife-to-be, after proposing to her, and we went to see her people and my people. She conceived and later had a miscarriage. We went to the clinic and they let us run a test and they found out that she has fibroid. She was very, very unrest. She was not comfortable with that. She was seeking for a solution and told me that she want to go to data state somebody told her of messy land i said why worry yourself the doctor will say that this can be operated and you still have your kids so later after flushing and evacuating she took in again and the same one collapsed miscarriage the second time so she couldn't bear it she left without even telling me, only called me on phone that she's on her way to Data State. I said, okay, I have you in my prayers. God grant you, Johnny Miss. So she came here, 240, spent four days, joined a program called You Must Carry My Samuel. And there, according to the story she told me when she came back, the man of God prophet. Jeremiah prayed for the apple and gave it to her that we put you pray and eat it together. She came back and brought the apple. I threw into her feet and we prayed and ate the apple together. 2 15, she conceived. No bleeding, no issues. Power! Power! I don't think you are celebrating this testimony, people of God. Can we put our hands wonderfully and beautifully for our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ once again? Throughout the pregnancy, I didn't see any issue or challenge. She was without pregnancy in 215 to god be the glory i lost my dad and my mom within a three weeks interval out of love the two of them went to answer god so in 216 she had my daughter whom i'm carrying here and uh, to the glory of god Power. i looked at it I said, ah, I said, this one, I will give her the name praise today. We give her the name praise God. And after burying my father and my mother, she said she wants to go to Mercy Land and give testimony for what God have used the man of God, Prophet Jeremiah, to do in her life. I said, okay, you know, I just came from out from Beria. I want to go with you so that we can give the testimony together. Before you know it, God put another one inside the belly. Power! And you are just sitting like that. People of God, wave your hands to the Lord God of our Papa and celebrate Him once again. Because Mercy City is the arena of solution and power, the factories of babies. And today we can see that our daddy, what he's saying now is. It's just overwhelmed. It doesn't even know how to describe it. It's blessings after blessings. And this is what the God of Prophet Jeremiah can do. 
if you are here facing similar problem experiencing miscarriages over your life because you are here under this grace the devil will put in shame that amen sound too religious can you say that amen louder than that let your amen sound like a thunder people of god clap for the lord once again sir what can you say about what this god of prophet jeremiah has done because definitely uh, what you went through in your marital life was really really pathetic and you know what you feel you knew it but today no more miscarriages in the life of your wife you are blessed with babies without any complication what word of advice can you give to people out there watching you right now mercy land arena of solution and power mercy land arena of solution and power my advice to viewers all over the world and everybody here today is that build up your faith faith is the vehicle that god has given us to carry us because my wife even left the result of that test when she came here she left the result here god it is now in your hand please my advice is that let us beat faith in god let us beat faith even through the prophet of god let us beat faith in him and he will surely see us through in people Jesus of god clap for the lord once again Yes, we would like to listen to your wife, sir. You're very much welcome once again. Tell us your name. And uh, what can you say about what this God of Prophet Jeremiah has done into your life? Mercy land. A run of solution and power. Mercy land. A run of solution and power. Give God the glory for what God has used Prophet Jeremiah to do in my life. I cannot say it all. I say, may his name be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So I believe as your husband said, you had miscarriages. And uh, how did you feel before coming down to Mercy City for prayers? I was feel bad when I had the miscarriage. So... I told my husband that I will come to Macy Land. <laughs> Being a man, he said, if you like, you go. If you don't like, I say I will go. Because with God, all things are possible. God will use Prophet Jeremiah and locate me. Then I come here with faith, with boldness. When I reach here, to God be the glory, God, you Prophet Jeremiah, and locate me. Daddy, pray for the apple. And I eat the apple together with my husband. Then I left my scan here. Say, God, you use Prophet Jeremiah, locate another people. My own will not be different. God of Jeremiah will do it in my life. Then I have that belief and leave the scan for here. The same that month, God do what no man can do for me. Power! Wow, people of God celebrate the Lord once again. Today, no more miscarriages. You are now restored through the God of our Papa. So, what word of advice can you give to viewers out there? There are thousands of women out there facing similar problems. What word of encouragement can you tell them right now? My advice for the viewer, they should, anytime they have problem. They should believe in God. Because with God, all things are possible. God that locates me will locate them. In Jesus' name. People of God, celebrate Jesus once again. Alors, cette femme se réjouit de son miracle, cher utilisateur. 
et tel que son mari a relaté depuis qu'ils se sont mariés, ils étaient à la recherche de filles des entrailles et toutefois que cette femme concevait, elle faisait toujours face à des fausses couches, elle avait ces euh, fausses couches euh, à deux reprises. Alors Dieu a se fait, cher utilisateur, elle fut déprimée et elle, est, elle a décidé de pouvoir venir à Mercy City pour la prière et elle a rencontré l'homme de Dieu à un de nos programmes, tu dois porter ton Samuel. Et c'est alors que, cher utilisateur, le Seigneur vraiment l'a rencontré à son point de besoin. Après la prière de l'homme de Dieu, l'homme de Dieu a béni sa paume et l'homme de Dieu lui a juste instruit de pouvoir manger de cette paume, se marier elle. Et lorsqu'elle a juste obéi à l'instruction de l'homme de Dieu, le Seigneur agit par l'affirmative et vraiment, ce qu'elle expérimentait par le passé a complètement disparu. Et lorsqu'elle a conçu, cher utilisateur, elle n'a pu expérimenter ses fausses couches, mais elle a couché librement et normalement avait réussi comme une femme hébreuse. Et cela s'est passé également au, à la prochaine grossesse, cher utilisateur. Elle est ici aujourd'hui avec toute sa famille pour dire... Merci au Dieu de prophète Jérémie pour ses bienfaits dans sa vie. Approchons pour le Seigneur. So we thank God Almighty for what he has done into your life. And I want to encourage you to be ruled by God's word in order to maintain this blessing. And let your wonderful testimony be permanent into your life in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.